I've not seen security this axe in a long time. Looks like they don't bother with cleaners either. How strange, especially with such a rare item on display. Think of the amount of not drugs I could get for that. Oh hello, what's happening fuckers? I'm kind of in the middle of something important right now, so if you're going to insist on sticking around, please hide in this hedge, and distract yourself with this review of Sly 3, Honor Among Thieves I have saved on this iPad. Anyway you have fun, I have to go get out the only guard with this pair of shoelaces. Let's get into it. After the critical success of Sly 2, Sly 3, Honor Among Us does not depart too radically from the previous title, instead attempting to refine the existing gameplay, while also adding new concepts and mechanics, in the hopes that lightning would strike twice. The game's plot revolves around our gang of furry bin invaders attempting to break into the Cooper Vault, a giant safe that houses all the Ethereum and other goodies that the Cooper family has collected over generations, which has been taken by the evil Dr. M, which definitely does not stand for Dr. Monkey. <laughs> To do so, they travel the world, recruiting the greatest experts in pinching shit. I have the power of God. Sly 3 follows the gameplay formula set out in the previous title very closely, with each level presenting a series of character-specific missions within an open world hub. Each character controls almost identically to Sly 2, aside from Bentley, who somehow manages to be more mobile, despite being in a wheelchair, with only the addition of new upgrades providing any notable difference for the other main characters. Not messing with the winning formula is one of Sly 3's greatest strengths, and allows it to attempt to improve on where the previous game fell short. One of the biggest innovations is the ability to replay missions at any time, and the addition of special challenges that add conditions to completing said missions, such as a time limit, or not being able to take damage, massively increasing the game's replay value. One other interesting addition was the game coming with a set of old school 3D glasses, which could be used in certain missions. From what I can tell, this adds absolutely nothing and was basically added as a marketing gimmick, but it does let me do this. Wow! That's not to say it's all sunshine blackjack and hookers, Sly 3 suffers significantly from trying to do too much, introducing whole new gameplay styles and mechanics, only to use them once or twice, before burning them off completely, and abandoning them like a father going out for cigarettes. Even the new playable characters feel wasted as a result, feeling criminally underused and underdeveloped, as a result of having to compete with 100 half-baked ideas of varying quality. This throw it at the wall and see what sticks approach leads to some inconsistency in the quality of the game's levels, in a way that isn't present in the previous title. For every section that I truly adore, such as the dog fighting or twin stick shooter sections, there is a mission that makes me feel completely fucking desolate, in a way that only the slight two tank mission and a one fem to second glance at the trending page can. What the f- what are you watching in my house? That's it. You... There's not a whole lot you can say regarding presentation with Sly 3. The game carries the same art direction as Sly 2, and maintains the same quality in regards to both graphics and music. Each level's soundtrack again draws from local influences, creating a distinct tone and feeling to each level. And while there are most likely some minor changes, overall the game looks great, but does not distinct itself from its predecessor in any significant way. Overall Sly 3 is a solid if flawed title the one I can still recommend. Building so heavily on the previous title it naturally draws comparison, but even with its occasional swing and miss, it is still overall a very strong entry in the series, and a must play for those who enjoyed the second title. Anyway I must be going. I finally got it. The greatest prize of all. Nothing can ruin this moment. Shit. 